So here we are at day 365 of the Mike Duffy trial. It surely feels that way, honestly. We have the same witness from the Senate uh, Human Resources Department, a woman named Sonia McClough, um, who is still in the stand for the third consecutive day, two of them in cross-examination. And uh, Mike Duffy's lawyer, Don Bain, finally wrapped up his two-day-long uh, cross-examination. And he threw out a couple of questions that the Crown had brought up in his uh, questioning of this same witness. These have to do with some small expenses that uh, were claimed on Mr. Duffy's behalf for pictures that were framed or enlarged and uh, that sort of thing. One of them was a picture of Barbara Bush. So Don Bain says to this witness, and that, here's that Barbara Bush photograph. That was for $34.50, is that right? And the witness, whose only job is to agree with him really, said, yeah, yes. And he said, and then there's a picture uh, for an enlargement of a photograph of Miranda and Colin. Now Miranda and Colin, Mr. Bain didn't say, but they are Mike Duffy's daughter and grandson. So anyway, he says, uh, and that, that cost $2, didn't it? And she said, yes, because she's just reading aloud as we all are, reading along as we all are. And I think the inference was pretty clear. The inference is, this is chicken feed. What are we doing wasting all these resources over these tiny amounts of money? To which I would reply, as a taxpayer, um, the amounts are small. So why didn't Mr. Duffy just pay for them himself? Surely that's what most of us do. When I get pictures of my family framed, I don't bill the National Post or Post Media. I pay for them because they're pictures of my family and it doesn't matter what the use of them is going to be, they're my responsibility. And if I move to send Paul Godfrey, the chairman of my company, can't imagine me moved to do this frankly, but if I were moved to send him a framed picture or a newspaper story that had been kind to him and send it to him, again, I wouldn't build a company, I'd pay for it myself because it's my kind gesture. So I think Mr. Bain has a point. Some of the amounts here are pretty tiny, but it cuts both ways. That's it for today.